here we see the little squirrels getting in food for the cold winter months. Yeah. And speaking of food, reminds me of toothpicks, which is the subject we're gonna give about today. And if you really want to know how they get their start in life, just watch what is happening here before your very eyes. Before your very eyes, a seed is buried in the ground. Yeah, the first step in the life of a toothpick. Uh-oh, double cross before he's even born. A month passes by. Yeah. Oh, a wise guy, eh? Another important step towards the birth of a toothpick. The little tree begins to grow, and in a few hundred years, it quickly grows up into a mighty redwood tree, which is loved and worshipped by Big Dan, a simple son of the woods. He's named it Sylvia. Hey, Dan. Show the customers how much you love Sylvia. Yeah, sure got big plans for you and me, Sylvia. <laughs> but the course of true love never runs smooth, and there's trouble a brewing for Dan and Sylvia. Listen. We're going, going, shopping, shopping, going, shopping, going. And all you have timber, 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 and drinking and do fall. We saw and saw and saw and saw. We don't make much money, but we have a lot of fun. And saw and saw and saw. We saw and saw and saw and saw. And saw. This is a crazy song. You strike me again and I'll clip you, so help me, I'll mow you down. Next to Sylvia, Dan loved himself best. Here he is talking things over with himself. Woodman, spare this tree. You can't make toothpicks out of she. Ah, what's the matter with you? I only want to cut it down. It's only a tree. No, a thousand times no. This hair tree is more than a tree. It bends Sylvia. Go, scaram. couldn't make toothpicks out of Sylvia. You don't say. Yeah, sure, I told them she was mine and I was gonna keep her. Cute boy, Dan, I'm proud of you. Make two picks out of Sylvia. Sylvia! 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 Where are you? Sylvia! Sylvia! Quiet! Sylvia! 
have just witnessed the voice of a toothpick before your very beautiful eyes.